So you welcome to another session of the ATU Library Tutorial Series. We have covered a lot uh, when it comes to the citation and the references or the generating the reference list. We can see that that uh, aspect that we covered is the uh, theoretical one, meaning just giving you an overview how actually your APA uh, citation and reference style should be. Uh, we covered, we started with citation references, then we narrowed down to the APA uh, citation reference style for the seventh edition. And our third tutorial on the reference and citation style, we also captured on the main differences between the APA 6th edition and that of the APA 7th edition. Things that has been updated uh, that uh, you have to note them when you are dealing with the APA 7th edition and not to repeat what we have in the 6th edition. Now, um, having worked through all these things, it means that we now have to use a software to organize our citations and references appropriately. So we decided to choose a reference manager to known as the Mendeley software. Now we are going to use this Mendeley software, as you see, uh, to organize our work when dealing with citations and references. Now one may ask what actually Mendeley is, and um, we will basically say that Mendeley is a free web and desktop reference management application. It's free, this software is free. Now, what is the benefit of this software? It helps you simplify your reference management workflow so you can focus on achieving your goals. So whatever you want to do with citation and references, this software will help you manage them very well. So we are saying that with Mendeley Reference Manager, you can store, organize, and search all your references from just one library. And that is what we have over here. So in our incoming tutorials, so the library tutorial that will be uploading very soon on our YouTube channel, we are going to cover everything about Mendeley from the beginner stage, remove to the uh, intermediate, then next to the advanced level so that you can do everything that you want to do with Mendeley. So we will, some of the things that we are going to cover, we have how you can add files in your Mendeley software, how you can also add folder, watch folder, basically what is the meaning of watch folder? So you have a folder on your desktop, uh, you're pushing some articles into that folder and you are telling Mendeley that, hey, Mendeley, look at that folder and populate all the new articles in that folder into my Mendeley reference management software. And we will take you through that, how you can also add an entry manually so that you can use that entry to do your citation and references. We can also, or we will take you through how you can import some information in the form of a uh, big text, EndNote and RIS. We will also take you through how you can do synchronization, export PDF with annotations. Then we also take you through some citation style that Mendeley has got in a lot of styles. How you can also download some styles over here. If you don't have it, how you can download them. We also take you through all these things. We also, if you are finding issues when it comes to um, installing Mendeley plugin in your Microsoft Word application, we also do that because Mendeley will be interacting with our uh, Microsoft Word as we start with the tutorials. So you have to get the Mendeley Word plugin so that you can, the two applications can interact or the two applications can work successfully. And then we are also going to take you through what we have over here. Um, this side, that is my library, will take you through how you can organize your work over here. Uh, one major thing that we'll cover over here is creating of folders and subfolders over here. So we have a folder and we have subfolder. We have folder and two subfolders. Taking you through the main importance of subfolders when you are creating folders in Mendeley. And so we have the create folder over here. We'll also be taking you through how you can use Mendeley to do a collaboration because Mendeley is very, uh, not only for citation and references, but you can use Mendeley's desktop management tool or software um, for collaboration. If you are working in groups, we'll also take you through that one. Uh, so you can create a group over here. Then we'll also take you through this particular 
station or I call it a work a workstation whereby um, you push all your materials in there and we also take you through what we have over here, how you can um, read an article over here, how you can also, um, a whole lot, a whole lot, a whole lot. So when we start with the tutorials, you are going to enjoy it. So how you can uh, mark your article as one that is favorite, one that is not favorite, how you can do highlighting in your article and so forth. And uh, we also capture this side. This side uh, normally brings out information that will be used for your references. You understand every aspect of this space. And we have so many things that Mendeleev can arrange its references for you, not only general articles. Mendeleev can do that for theses, the web pages, working paper, conference proceedings, and so forth. So it's going to be an interesting one. There are so many things that we are going to cover uh, in our Mandarin tutorial. And um, trust me, you just have to subscribe to our YouTube channel so that um, whenever there is a release of any Mandarin video, um, you pick it up or you, you move with us as we start from the basic to the intermediate and finally to the advanced level. We hope to meet you and um, enjoy our tutorial series. And thanks very much for subscribing to our YouTube channel.